Now let's have a listen to a cue I just wrote here in Cubase. Alright, so this song is builded around this chord progression here. So F minor, D flat, A flat, and then E flat. And I repeat with F minor, D flat. Then back to the A flat and I finish on this B flat here. The first thing is that I wrote the strings, so the string sounds like this. So what happens here is that my first and second violins, they're doing exactly the same thing, as, except this note here. So they're taking the whole melody, and then I have this uh, counter melody here with violas and celli descending. And as you can see, both instruments are playing the same thing, right? Exactly an octave of difference. And then my basses uh, just support the chords, right? Nothing very impressive here. So this is my string section. Then I wrote some brass just to support the whole harmony. So let's listen to what is happening here. So I have this short uh, horn here, short part here doing some ba ba ba. Just to support the end of the cue. Then I wrote some woodwinds. Let's listen to them alone. So as you've heard, they're mainly doing longs or fake legato. Let's listen to the flute with the violins to see what is the interaction between both sections. Okay, good. What you just heard at the end here is what we call a run. I tried my best with that patch, which is a long patch, but that's how it sounds. And I doubled this with the piccolo. So when played together... Okay, then my low woodwinds, the clarinet and bassoon, they're just helping the harmony. Let's listen to it. They're kind of doing the same thing as the viola and the celli, if we compare them. Alright, and then I wrote some percussion, really, really subtle, a timpani and some cymbals and some toms.
All right, and then I wrote some uh, harp and celeste here that is helping the melody in the second part of the cue. So we have a harp doing a glissandi here. And the celeste is helping the melody. <laughs> Alright, so the whole thing now... Alright, this is it. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free.